The National Weather Service is continuing to connect reports of the tornado and this trailer that flipped on 4th and Fancher in Spokane Valley. Crime 2's Janelle Finch spoke to some of the community members who went through and that area that live that live there where that tornado in one Spokane Valley trailer park. Cody, this community is seeing the damage from last night's storm in the light from broken glass to uprooted trees to even a trailer flipping onto another. One resident told me that she was so scared after last night's storm that she actually spent the night out of her home. Mobile home residents say Friday's storm was unlike anything they've ever seen. One thing to hear about tornadoes, but to be have it at your doorstep is a yeah. whole nother thing. Extreme winds brought down trees and caused significant damage in the RV neighborhood off of 4th Avenue. One resident watched a tree sway outside her home and says she feared for her life. Me and my brother were in the trailer closest to the, the tree and I was like, this could have gone a whole different way. I could have lost my brother and I could have died or get seriously injured. That tree ended up falling between her and her neighbor's home. Now, even though the storm is over, that resident says she still can't shake the feelings she felt that night. But I'm still like really nervous about it and scared. Down the street from her, the storm also caused a trailer to flip onto another trailer. When Spokane Valley fire crews arrived on scene, they found two people trapped in one of the mobile homes. You know, one of them, one gentleman said that evening he just finished talking to his wife and uh, said he was going to lay down and take a nap. And the next thing he knew, he was upside down. Spokane Valley fire officials say the two people were not harmed. Today, it was all about picking up the pieces. This road behind me was actually blocked off by trees. As you can see, crews have removed those trees and traffic is now flowing through again. In Spokane Valley, Janelle Finch, Crem 2 News. Janelle, thank you so much. And just a few blocks from where that trailer flipped, trees came down on East 5th Street. This large one right here took out two cars, damaging one and destroying the other. The owners say they had actually just cut down a tree about a month ago to prevent something like this. And just a few houses down, a home heavily damaged after a tree toppled onto it. This house was in the area where the tornado was spotted. No one was hurt when this tree fell into the home, but you can see the damage right there splitting through the roof.